Hey guys, and welcome back to my playthrough of Control. Um, I should be having a mic from now on. I had to get it all set up and figure out ways to go about it. Um, but yeah, if you haven't seen the first episode, I suggest you go watch it because there's a lot that happens already in the 20 minutes that I play, and without it, you're probably wondering why all these people are floating and what's going on. And why this girl is like inhumanly strong. Just demolishes desks left and right, apparently. But yeah, to keep going. Um, let's see. This is definitely different than where I was when I died last episode. But it's still interesting. Material. Got assets. You do not have a clearance level. Hmm. So I'm not sure. I keep getting those assets. Not sure what they are. Martial awe investigations. We checked out the suspected awe and do it. Um, yeah, nothing that interesting there. Still not entirely sure. I don't know why I'd want to be locked in here. If there's any purpose, apparently not. <laughs> kind of lost now. Guess I go through these doors. Yep, there we are. The sound that tried to invade me earlier. The hiss burrowing into everything in this place. Play the some music. <laughs> All right, it's Does that do anything? burrows in like an infuriating melody that made <sighs> Are you here to see someone? I don't it's know what I'm here for yet. <laughs> oh, more? Urban legends. Altered materials, altered world event. Well, I know a few urban legends myself, so that's interesting. And here's where I died last time. Also, sorry that my aim is just awful. There's what I don't want to mess with. Is this like the first mini boss, maybe? Oh, I want that health over here. Oh my god. Oh my god, my aim's off! It works. What are these hidden trends? I don't know what to do. Apparently I don't have the ability to do anything yet. Health recovery, equip. That'd be nice. Weapon mods. Damage while low on health. Might as well add it if I have it. Cleanse the control point. What does that mean? Hmm. Let me fix it. Um. It's not weird or anything. Holy shit! You did it! We did it! <laughs> Fast travel. Are you still 
Where's the intercom? Please talk to me. We saw you. Headshot boost. Well, that's interesting. I can still only do one. Um, so my damage goes up versus headshot. I'll do the headshot. Is it safe to come out? I might just be dumb, but I don't see this intercom. Interesting. Is it this? Ah, oh, there it is. I can't tell you how happy I am to talk to somebody sane. The feelings mutual. Yeah, I'm Pope, Emily Pope, and Dr. Darling's assistant. My turn. Should I lie? Jesse Faden. I'm just visiting. I should have lied. <laughs> Shit! You're the new director. So this just seems like some fucked up corporation, honestly. What is she wearing? What is that? Director. Fade. Call me Jesse. Okay, Jesse. I'm Emily. Look, somehow this hostile force, this hiss, that works. Somehow the hiss managed to infiltrate the building without any warning. And just like that, my name for it is official. The hiss. <laughs> The like hiss. The sound of poison gas leaking in. We're in full lockdown. It seems to have spread everywhere and to everyone not protected by an HRA. And, extraordinarily, you. You are the director, and that makes you special by definition. Trench is no longer the director, obviously. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm talking too much. This whole she does talk a lot. A lot. Trench is dead. Shot. Ah. I found his body. And the gun. The way teller it looked like a suicide. The service weapon. Also, and this can sound crazy, but he keeps appearing to me, saying things. It's hard to make out, but he told me to cleanse the control point. Weird. The whole room shifted around. You did that? And you entered the building when it was already in the lockdown before you became the new director? How? I'm not ready to tell her about you yet. A janitor let me in. <laughs> I love it. This is fucking unbelievable. It's... I can't even... Ugh, look, Jesse, I have a million questions and probably have a million more. Like, do you know my brother Dylan? Not Whoa. yet. But there's something I need to ask you to do first. If you can cleanse a control point, then you can maybe cure those infected or possessed by the hiss. Because if that's possible, our options are very different. Emily Pope. I don't know her. But I like her already. She's the opposite of the faceless agency I blamed for what happened to me for so long. But I can't trust her yet. Or rather, the bureau she's a part of. Yes. I can try. I'm speaking <laughs> for you, of course. We can try it together. Interesting. Okay. Are you with me? We did it before. Push the hiss out. So is this girl literally some kind of like exorcist now? What? It didn't work. The hiss 
has burrowed too deep. Ripping it out rips them apart. Oh shit. I can't cleanse them. I saw. It was worth a shot. Thank you, Director. Jesse. I'm gonna tell <laughs> her why I'm here. I'll risk it. Listen. The Bureau was involved in an incident in my hometown. Orphan. I would not risk it for the biscuit this early. The Bureau came in and covered the whole These people don't exactly seem very sound. That's enough. Maybe that's too much already. Definitely too much. About Dylan and the rest yet. I've seen mentions of an altered world event case dealing with ordinary. You were at Ground Zero as a child? It was one of the big ones, and before my time. And very classified. I can try to dig out some old files for you. My boss, Casper Darling, would know, but he's missing. I think he knew this was coming, or suspected. He came up with the HRAs, the Hedron Resonance Amplifiers. I think they're what <laughs> saved us. A few of us. And director Seems Trench suspicious. Know. Trench. The ghost, or whatever he is. He mentioned something called the hotline. Said I should find it. It's another object of power, like the gun. An old Bakelite telephone. A direct line of communication between the director and the board. Maybe he can talk to you more clearly through that. I mean, Trench has years and years of experience. He might know how to destroy the hiss. So now we have to talk Where to the, the ghost it's guy. It's the communications department through the mail room. It's part of this sector, so we can access it even with the lockdown in place. We'll get the door open for you. Okay, that's my next stop. That's Tomasi's department. He's the head of communications. I don't think he had an HRA. He kind of made a point about not wearing one earlier. Keep an eye out. Why would he not want to wear one? That's not me. I'm not a director type. I'm not a leader. Why am I here? I think you already know. Yes, I came for my brother, but there are other reasons too. I said I was looking for answers, but I might never understand them. <laughs> hmm. I'm not looking for proof. This is already it. More than enough. No yeah, that this place is a mess. Years, I know it's real now. I didn't imagine this. I want to be a part of this world. There's so a lot of cutscenes to this so it. far, which is good. I to see the hiss destroy it all. But also, I feel like more like I'm watching. An interactive movie. Is this the hotline? There's they definitely some stupid questions. Just outside the boardroom back in the lobby. They should have gotten it open right now. Mm, there nice. it is again. Got a Welcome message. I don't want to do these materials yet since I don't have clearance, so that's kind of interesting. Hmm. So I wonder what happens when you deconstruct, because this gives me less, so why would I want to use it?
It was worth a try. <laughs> That looks terrifying. So I'm just gonna have all this stuff and have no idea what to do with it. Travel expenses, mini bar. Oh my goodness. So weird to me to not have to reload and it just reloads for me. Uh, that would be my guess on where to go. Oh no, that's not where I should have went. <laughs> okay. Well that was interesting. This loading screen, however, is pretty dope. Huh. All right. My question is, why is this guy? He almost looks from far away like he's a fog on him. Weird. No, I don't remember which way to go. Was it this way? Yes, yes it was. There it is again. A welcome message. Advice, don't go down there. Oh, apparently I can move the bodies. Now they're spawning. And they're just gonna spawn like that, huh? Somebody just leaves classified information in the toilet, apparently, and I press the wrong button. Let's see, hiss barrier. Hmm. I think this might be a good place to stop. And part three should be up soon.